While I thought it was a great piece of content, really engaging, really interesting, the first episode of the new Don't Hug Me I'm Scared series uh, kind of scared the bejesus out of me, both in a visceral sense as well as just a broad overall existential crisis kind of way. My favourite, as you all know. Very, very fond of that. So of course I was like, yeah, episode two called Death. Joy of joys. <laughs> Before we start, I thought I'd let you know that I have a gaming channel. Most recently, I've been playing some Five Nights at Freddy's over there for the first time, and that's also something that's caused a change in my life. So if you'd like to see me play some games, the link will be in the description below. Uh, why is yellow guy just well, stunned? I'm dead. Huh? Dead. What? I do like that the characters' reactions were pretty much the same as mine. <laughs> How did you die? I forgot to drink water. <laughs> <laughs> why is he laughing at it? Just me. Why do you get to that's that, get to be dead. Yeah, somebody's jealous. I am mildly baffled by this episode. Why is Red Guy jealous of him being dead, and why is the duck so playful about it? I always knew I deserved to be dead. Just I'm more. What the hell? I'd better get changed into my Sunday best. <laughs> I swear, if something hatches from that. This is very strange even for Don't Hug Me, I'm Scared. Normally it gets strange after something happens or someone comes and takes them on an adventure. It's not just weed in their own house. So uncomfortable. What the hell? Oh boy. Hi. Hello. The very cheery greetings. This is not how I would respond, I'll tell you that much. But I guess they're just used to all this weird shit happening, man. Oh, I've been wow. thinking about getting something like that. A On TV. A television. Yeah. Am I just the duck guy? I swear to God. So often I'll just say something and then immediately afterwards he'll say the same thing. I've been given a wreath. It's just him, is it? Because I feel like I... Bro, why do you want to die so bad? Yeah, I bet you do, but I've only got one down here. I bet you do. Imagine being called out so hard by literal death. Yeah, I bet you want to be dead. Your life sucks. Well, there's many ways to check if you don't believe me. You can do this. Whoop. Ooh. Doesn't that hurt? Huh. Not that much. My turn. No! Ow. Not you, silly. This must be a very hard time for you. <sighs> Three minutes in, he chopped off his finger. There's still some blood around the hole over there. And uh, this coffin guy be kind of freaking me out. Weird, soft-spoken ASMR voice. This must be a very hard time for you. Oh, it's not, not good. And you can also check your ID card. Don't be silly. You don't die for ages. Oh. You die in the lake. Huh? I think you drown. Why does the ID card know? I said we've got a lot of work. We gotta get things ready for the big day. This show makes me feel things and confronts me in ways I don't think I was ever prepared to be confronted. Cutting out bunting and making a cake. So he's preparing his own funeral and making a cake for it? Need to figure out which tie to choose. I don't even know where this is going to go. It's throwing me well and truly. Brushing my teeth. I, I didn't need to see that. Fuck, that's horrifying. <laughs> First you heat up the margarine Make sure you're using fresh minced beef Am I tripping? Add a little bit more margarine Rat egg Ready for the big day what? what are we doing? Oh no, it's the funeral, it's the funeral, sorry Uh-huh It's just a lot guys, really That's what it comes down to David He's got a name Hey guys You alright? Hello Thanks for coming. Hey, hey, no talking. Remember, you're dead. Oh, so he's going to get buried? <laughs> Silly me. Why does it say David? Huh? <laughs> That's his name. He's David. His. What? That's supposed to be your name. So uh, his name isn't David? But what, the coffin guy just picked a random name? I'm your best friend. I didn't... Yeah. We're close. I mean, I know you. I know which one you are. Look, I'm leaving you all my stuff. Oh, my God. God! Look, if you knew someone was dying and you were sharing what seems to be your last words with them, would you use those to be like, 
We're not really best friends, what are you talking about? Just not along, let him die in peace, you know? I could do the lovely remark. I don't want you, I want my, oh my best friend. Oh my god! Your best hey friend. look, just speak from the heart. It's the saddest, weirdest funeral of all time. Okay, great, thank you. Beautiful stuff. Oh, uh, this is so weird. What's happening? <laughs> Even for don't hug me, I'm scared. This is weird. It's so abstract and nothing's happening, but everything's happening. He's dead, but is he not dead? And what's the dynamic going on between everyone? Is it gonna turn out that he had like some long lost twin whose name was David and then he thought he was dead, but actually his twin David didn't drink water and perished of dehydration, I guess. <laughs> oh my God. Busted out, yellow guy. Hey, oh, wow, it was I so gorgeous. Right, down we go. Why is yellow guy the only one that's picking up on all this? I said, it's just gonna be me and you from here on. Yeah. Just... Until the other guy comes back. This is so sad, it's like explaining death to a child. Oh, come on, it's, it's not that bad. We didn't really like him anyway. I am trying my best to piece together what exactly is happening. Obviously, they're gonna get him back. I just have no clue how. Who are you? Hey. A bunch of mourners? How about a tissue? God, this would be the most unnerving, weird thing to experience after a friend dies. The tissues are called sad squares. <laughs> I just don't understand how Don't Hug Me, I'm Scared manages to make things so unsettling with relatively innocent visuals. Yeah, this is creepy, but it's not shot like a horror movie or has a bunch of gore. It's just deeply shaking my soul in a very weird way. Don't forget about your goodie bag. Sorry for your love. Can you just for one second imagine handing out a goodie bag at a funeral? Hey, thanks for coming to mourn the death of this loved one. Here's a goodie bag and for one lucky winner, there's a free iPad. This is so sad now, what the hell? What do you think happens when we die? Well, I guess nobody huh? really I... knows. No! <laughs> Not the lamp! Some people think we even come back as our favorite animal or object. <laughs> wow. I'm not okay. I need to go to sleep now. Good night. Oh my god, I wish I could do that. Just flick a switch and make myself go to sleep. Oh, never needed something more. Says she's a classic. Mm. Look, I have a hat for weekend. I don't understand how this is a new friend kit. Are they making one? No, I don't like him. He wants I don't the like duck. Any of them. Oh. Hey. I want the old one back. I love that they don't even seem to know his name. Just this guy, him, the old one. Smash. Mm. New friend. Ugh. Oh, terrifying. Animation. Hey, don't say that. Don't hurt his feelings. <clears throat> uh, sorry about him. He's just upset because the other guy went into a hole. Oh, I am hole. No. I mean, I kind of like the little thing, but certainly a choice. I will say I appreciate the red guy as being so polite to it, treating it with mad respect. Oh my god, he's been replaced in all the photos already. Are they going to turn the pink blob into the duck? Basically the same. Basically the same. Yeah, no change at all. I don't know what you're talking about. Has he got a light bulb? Is that what that is? Wow, what a beautiful service. Very moving. I would hate to be trapped with that guy. It's just this. Is it? Okay. I'm gonna shoot off. Got quite oh, not even being trapped with him, just vibing there alive. Bye. Oh boy, the eyes turning. It's not hey, nice. Hey, how can I help? Hello. Should we play a game? Hmm? Should we play snooker? Um, or maybe beach volleyball? Call me crazy, but I don't think they have the space for that. I also don't think the duck is fully grasping his situation. He seems to not at all be aware of what's happening. And remember, the buzzer is only for when you really need me. <laughs> is the duck going to annoy him so much that he, like, gives him life back? This is cause for celebration, my boy. Let's heat up some water. What on God's earth? How is the show on the show, weirder? Wow. Hello, Stain. That's a funny word. Oh, I love them. They're so cute. No, that's not really a name. Stain Edwards, the forever boy. Stain Edwards. Hell yeah. And I sit here, do I? Hi, but that's his chair. I feel bad that Yellow Guy's being so mean. I understand it. You know, he's grieving. But also, Pink Blob, kind of love him. Want him to be a main character. Us three 
on our crazy adventures. Who knows what might happen? Yeah, look how hyped they are. Take on anything. Life grows at all. I used to be a blob of nothing at all, but now okay. I walk and talk. Okay, you know, you can stop there. That's fine. I think you're cool and I like you, but I don't want to see these visuals while you sing strange lyrics at me, please. Can that be arranged? I want to thank you for this opportunity. Oh, the blending is something, something, man. And why are we even here? What's our purpose? No, stop it. Here's the existential crisis. It's interesting just to think. Yeah. It is interesting to think about being in a simulation, and it throws me for a loop. So if we could just stop right there, stop that line of thinking, that would be very much appreciated. I'm getting my core values. Honestly. <laughs> the spirit of adventure. Finance. Stop it. Oh. oh. Yeah, that's not really the kind of thing we do. Oh. Why not? Bro, Blob's so excited. Just sit here and stuff will happen. Something normally. I feel bad for the Blob. I hope it goes off on its own, has its own adventures. We don't talk about that area. Yeah. Oh my god, it's so ominous. I can't help it. Stop looking at it. It's beautiful. Oh. Beautiful bloody floorboards with an explosion there. The world is so full of wonder. Oh, it's not so wholesome. Wrong without... <laughs> the other guy at least had his own clothes. You don't have clothes. Yeah, I'm not supposed to have clothes. This is how I look. Okay. Oh. Dude, I thought this blob was gonna freak me out, make me feel really uncomfortable. Instead, I'm just feeling sad for it. I wanted to have a great time. Look how sad this little guy is. He deserves the world. Give him the world. There's only a couple minutes left. How's the duck gonna come back? Or maybe he's not. Is that just the plot for this season? He left in the fridge. Oh, that's gone off. Sorry. Memory. Oh, God. Having a beak. I really feel like he used to have a Oh, that is creepy, bro. Don't make the blob the duck. The shovel that we left outside. What horror is he going to uncover when he hits the coffin? I'm tense. I, I don't know what the hell I'm gonna see in a second. And out goes the music. Everything gets a bit more uncanny and dark. Stop it. I can't do this anymore! Now you hold the newspaper. Do I? Did he just like kill death? I feel like you have some issues you need to just work. Just hold the newspaper. Oh, so that's. Is this the blob now? Yes, here. I'm dead. No, no, that's the old one. Right. Yeah. It's a confusing situation. Hmm? <laughs> okay, so they. Oh my god, they made the blob turn itself into the duck. That's that's so freaky, so sad. Stop. This poor blob. It just burst into existence, into a dynamic of two people who are mourning a friend and putting all that on the poor little blob. Justice for Stain Edwards. Okay. We didn't think you were coming back, so... So, you replaced me with this thing. Oh my well, god. Really? No, come on. Don't don't hurt the blob. Don't do it. Oh. Now there's four of us. There's four of us. There's four of us. Okay. I will just accept this new reality, I guess. This showman. Sometimes we have too it's much just... fun. We have to go to bed. Uh, Actually, no. Four doesn't work. Wait. There's three of us. But the blob was on the left before. So did the blob just kill the real one? I believe Stain Edwards has committed a murder. Is that going to be canon from now on? Or did they maybe just somehow switch places? Maybe we're not meant to know. Cool. I am very, very happy for all the characters. Glad that everything worked out wonderful. If it was Stain that died, I feel horrifically bad for its short and very unfulfilling existence. But I guess that's just what Don't Hug Me, I'm Scared does to people. Especially people who aren't the main characters. I've got nothing else in me, nothing else to say. So thank you so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please don't forget to click that like button. And as always, have an awesome time until I see you next. See ya.